The people of Turkey have a fascinating mix of features, some look Mediterranean, some more Middle Eastern, and others even have Central Asian or European traits. But why is that? What do the genetics say about how Turks actually look? Today, we're diving deep into the phenotype of the Turkish people. Are Turks more Middle Eastern, more European, or do they still carry features from their ancient Turkic ancestors? The answer is in their DNA. Let's break it all down. Turkey's population is diverse, but certain traits are more common than others. Most Turks have olive-toned skin dark hair, and brown eyes, reflecting their Anatolian and Middle Eastern ancestry. But lighter features, like hazel or green eyes, wavy light brown or even blonde hair, do appear in some regions. Genetically, around 60% of Turkish men carry markers from ancient Anatolian and Middle Eastern farmers, haplogroups like J2, J1, G, and E. These groups have been in the region for thousands of years, shaping the dominant features seen in modern Turks. But there's also European influence. About 25% of Turks carry carry haplogroups, R1A, R1B, and I, markers linked to Indo-European migrations and ancient European populations. These genes are more common in Western and Northern Turkey, which is why some Turks have lighter hair and eyes. What about the Turkic migration from Central Asia? It left a genetic imprint, but it's smaller than many assume. Around 5-10% to of Turkish DNA comes from East Asian-related haplogroups like Q, C, O, and N. This influence is more visible in some regions, particularly in Central Anatolia. So, what's the typical Turkish look. Most Turks have a mix of Mediterranean, Caucasian, and Central Asian features. Sharp cheekbones, almond-shaped eyes, and straight or wavy dark hair are common. Lighter traits like fair skin, blonde hair, and blue or green eyes are rare but still found, especially in parts of Western and Northern Turkey. So, are Turks from the East or the West? The answer is both. Their phenotypes reflect their diverse genetic past, blending ancient Anatolian, Middle Eastern, European, and Central Asian influences. Which traits do you think think best represent Turkish people? Let know us in the comments. And if you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share for more genetic content. See you next time.